Bimodal IT. In Gartner Glossary, bimodal IT refers to having two modes of IT, each designed to develop and deliver information and technology intensive services in its own way. Mode 1 is traditional, sequential, emphasizing safety and accuracy. Here in Mode 1, the focus is on stability. Mode 2 is exploratory and nonlinear and emphasizing on speed. As in Mode 2, the main focus is on agility. According to Gartner, bimodal IT is the practice of managing two separate, coherent modes of IT delivery, one focused on stability and the other on agility, so that CIOs can help their departments meet the digital challenge and ultimately bring the enterprise along. Each mode has all the resources, partners, structure, people, methodologies, metrics, and attributes towards value and risk that its operation requires. New investments are deployed through one of the two modes and depending on the balance of needs. As and when the change is required or the balance changes, the existing investments and operations can be swapped over between model 1 and model 2. One important thing to keep in mind is that, the two modes of bimodal IT, meant to operate in simultaneous coexistence, yet challenging IT strategies within the same organization. In an abstract level, a bimodal concept takes shape from, the idea that in some organizations, it is unrealistic to assume we will reach a point, where we can shift entirely to agile. In some environments, it won't make sense to make the switch. There are many reasons a business might decide to obligate, or not obligate to this shift, and Gartner Glossier makes this clear, by the help of an illustrate picture. Here the differences between the two modes, are coined in with an example of a marathon runner, to a sprinter. digital difference between what IT can provide, and what actually the organization need is widening, and bimodal IT is capable of addressing these issues. The digital demands of business division, stem from the combination of business pressures, and the disruptive digital trends, which in turn exhaust its scope. Decision making teams will end up, in minimal ability to forecast the future, of their competitive environments, markets, and value chains. The same teams, seek ways to mitigate stakeholder risks, and exploit business opportunities. And at the same time, the business wants to leverage value from consumerization of IT, social, mobile, cloud, information and analytics, and the Internet of Things. All of this leads to, the digital divide widening between, what the IT organization can provide, and what the enterprise actually wants or needs. Speeding up IT. CIOs, often need to respond to the harsh technology shift, within their own organizations. The solution to such a scenario is bimodal IT, where Mode 1 operates traditional IT services, emphasizing safety and accuracy. Whereas Mode 2 emphasizes agility and speed, like a digital startup. In short, bimodal IT will focus on part of IT on delivering solutions quickly 
and enabling business as a whole to move faster. Risk of Shadow IT Organizations stand the risk of an explosion of shadow IT, without bimodal IT leadership. This is the age-old observable fact that, where unofficial investment in IT occurs around the enterprise, often unknown to all. This is not merely decentralized IT. Shadow IT sidesteps the designated IT organization, to derive value from technology. The growth in shadow IT, is a sign of users' desire to control their technological destiny. This is due to their discontent, with the IT organization's current methods, or increasing confidence in their ability. How to implement bimodal IT? We have to keep in mind that a bimodal is very experimental, there is no clear cut way. You have to do it to learn it. To implement bimodal IT efficiently, all you have to do is to make four key stages, or the 4P to work. Portfolio People Process And Platform Portfolio Identifying the project ideas, and put them in some sort of priority order. Take care of different stages of the project, like research, prototype, pilot, in market etc. and make sure you have a clear budget, and criteria guidelines for each stage. Identifying and incorporating the right people. After the priorities have been outlined, think about the people, who will be able to deliver. This should include, creating a cross-functional team consists of both technology, and business savvy people. Developers should be able to cooperate closely with users, and bridge the gap from technical opportunities, and business outcomes. Apt Process Many people believe, that bimodal IT only requires a focus on agile development. In reality, focus on agility is crucial, but you will also need to develop DevOP practices, so that your project enjoys the deployment agility, necessary for continuous releases, based on feedback. In addition, these projects will need their own governance framework, that outlines how the solution should operate, and ensures these principles are embedded into continuous development. The right platform. While cloud platforms often provide the speed, and agility, needed for bimodal IT projects, don't forget, that the platform should be suitable for the application's landscape, and deployment. Cloud is generally cost-saving, and speeds up the time, but it can be difficult to implement with some systems. It is important for business leaders to understand, that bimodal IT does not address all the issues IT faces, but it is a process to speed up the organization's response, to customer needs. The challenge is getting all parties, to work together, including staff, processes, and technology, to fully realize the benefits of bimodal IT.